Hi everyone, um, I've had a request to do a Barbie video. So, um, although I only have a small Barbie collection and I don't know who most of them are, um, that's what I'm going to do. So, Ibrahim, this is for you. <laughs> right, so we'll start with this one. Now, I don't particularly collect Barbies. What I collect is dolls that I think are pretty and, you know, I don't specifically collect Barbie type dolls. So these dolls may not be in their right outfits or anything, but they're dressed because I think they look pretty and because... So this is one of your um, typical blue-eyed girl, blue-eyed blonde-haired girls. I think she's a, a Mattel one. Yeah, she is. Yeah. But I, like, I really like her outfit and I thought she had a really sweet face. So that's why I kept her. Yeah, so that's number one. Um... Next is this lady. Um, I have absolutely no idea who she is, but I, th I like her because she has an unusual face. And I think she's in her original outfit because her um, necklace is sewn to her top still. She has on a couple of bracelets. She's got quite long hair. Um, she's got jeans and then she's got these yellow boots on. Yeah, I did look at the numbers on her back, but I couldn't... Um, I couldn't find anything when I looked her up. I've looked her up a few times, but I've never found found who she is. So if anybody knows, she's got some pretty like diamond shaped earrings and her necklace is a moon shape. Yeah, but I like her. She's one of my favourite ones, actually. Yeah, yeah. So that's her. Next, I have this one now this is not a barbie this is a simba she's a roller skating simba doll and i just i don't know what it is about her i just liked her so i kept her yeah this is how she came she came dressed like this and she's got on a little roller blades look yeah i think she's quite an old doll i don't know yeah but she's she's a she's a simba one and even though she's had her hair washed it's still got that gray grayish undertone to it but yeah she's quite a cute dolly isn't she yeah next i have this one she's quite a recent one for me this one is and somebody did tell me who she was um she's princess charm school barbie this one is um she didn't come with her top but what i've done is this is a dress can you see look there's the bottom of the dress and but this is her original skirt and uh, I wanted a white top for her and I didn't have one. So rather than cut the dress, I've just popped that skirt on over the top of the skirt that came with the dress. Yeah, she's really pretty as well, isn't she? I like her, I like her little bows in her hair and I like her little skirt and that. She's got on some little pink shoes too. Yeah, so this is the charm school Barbie, yeah. Yeah. Um... Then I have this one. This is Annalise. She should really be with my princess Barbie, shouldn't she? I have a collection of um, Disney princess dolls. I suppose she should be with them, really. But yeah, this is uh, Annalise from The Princess and the Pauper, and she sings as well. And I love her. Absolutely love her. I don't have the the I don't have the Erica, but I have the Annalise. Yeah, and she's got a lovely love her dress. Yeah, and she's got some little pink shoes that she's been donated because she came without shoes. Yeah, but she's she's lovely. I really like her. She's another one of my favourites. Um, then I have this one. Someone did tell me who she was. She's something like Butterfly Dream or something. Do you know I'm terrible? I'm sure it's got. I'm sure her name has nothing to do with butterflies. Yeah, but she is a. She's got this button here that you press, and when you press it, up come her wings, see? She's very fancy, this one is. Yeah. Yeah. I did actually have the Spy Squad Barbie as well, but um, my little granddaughter, Rosie, absolutely loves the Spy Squad one, and she's she's been donated to Rosie, yeah. Rosie got her for being brave. <sighs> Yeah, so this is, she's a pretty one, isn't she? I just I'm just quite fascinated with her, really. She's not really the sort of doll that I would collect, but I'm just quite fascinated with her. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah, and I'm, I'm not sure whether she came with these shoes. I think she actually did. Yeah, but she's she's quite a new doll as well. I think I've not had her for that long. Then I have this one, which is one I believe she's a fairy topia one. 
and I love, I'm not too bothered about her body, not in the least, but I love her face. Look at her face. She's got rooted eyelashes too and I love her hair. I had to redo her hair, but I think it's come, it's come out pretty well. Yeah, it, can you see it's got tiny little plaits wound around the big part of her hair. Yeah, she's a really pretty doll. I absolutely love her. If I could rebody her, I probably would. Because she's got gold legs, look. Yeah, a bit odd them. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's her original outfit. I think, well, if it's not her original one, it's the one that she came in. Um, then I have this one. She is a, a more recent doll as well, I think. But I really liked her face. One of my pet hates is these painted on clothes. But I let her off because I liked her face. Yeah, she's got a pretty face, hasn't she? I'm sure she's a, like a newer one. But her necklace is still elasticated on and her bag was still elasticated to her hand. Yeah, and she's got little, pretty little dainty lilac shoes on. Yeah. Like I say, I don't know who most of these are. I'm hopeless, aren't I? Sorry about that. And then here I have... Some little mini I have my little mini princess in the paw, pauper doll so this is Erica oh this is Annalise I love her little dress look at it I love these dollies look how tiny her little faces <laughs> she's so pretty and then we have the Erica look at Erica isn't she pretty <laughs> yeah so that because I haven't got the big the like standard 11 inch size one these are the little mini ones I don't know whether they're called Mini World or something. I can't remember what they're called, but yeah, I really like those two. Yeah, I know who they are. Erica and Annalise from the Princess and the Pauper. Yeah. And then I have this one. She's a princess to pop star, Barbie. No matter what you do with her hair, it will not look tidy. It won't. And I don't like it at all. Uh, she's got one type of hair, hair, hair here in the purple, and when you turn it round to the, this is, oh, hold on, yeah, Princess to Pop Star Barbie, this one is, and I think this is the princess one with the brown hair, and when you turn it round, this hair is, is a different kind of hair, yeah, it is, it's not the same, not the same type of hair, that underneath is finer and more easily knotted, yeah, but she's a pretty doll. And she's got a little button there and she's got her microphone and her dress switches. You can switch her dress from a princess gown to a to a pop star gown. So that's her that's her princess mode with her brown hair and her, her dress on. And then you can switch her dress round and switch her hair round. And it's never tidy, this hair isn't. No matter what you do to it, it never looks tidy. Yeah, and that's her with her in her pop star mode yeah and you, if you press the button when she's got batteries in she sings for you yeah then I have this one she is quite a recent acquisition of mine as well uh, again the reason I kept this one was because I love this top I absolutely love it it's got all the rainbow colours on it and little birds and all sorts yeah so I kept her for a top I don't know who she is she's a Mattel Barbie Nineteen ninety nine. It says on her body. Yeah, I can't. I can't actually see what it says on her head. No. But yeah, she's got on a little pink crown, and she's she's a really pretty, really pretty one, isn't she? Yeah. Yeah, and that top's a clip on one. It, it clips on and off. She's got like a pink painted body underneath. And you just pop that on. Yeah. Yeah. Then, considering I haven't got many, I've actually got quite a few, haven't I? This is another little fairy topia dolly that I keep with my um, Barbie and Barbie type doll collections. Yeah, she's quite sweet, isn't she? She came out well in the wash. Yeah, and she's all green look with little tiny flowers on her tootsies. I like those. Cuteness. Yeah, I like her. Then this one, she, I know she's not a Mycene, but she reminds me of the Mycene dolls and I collect Mycene. Uh, but she, I just love her. I love her face. She's such a pretty doll, isn't she? And I've dressed her in this outfit. She's got on a white t-shirt. Um, this is a, a jacket that I got. It came on a... What on earth is that? 
who knows this jacket came on another doll but i absolutely love it yeah these are jeans from the pound shop barbie jeans from the pound shop and these are my scene boots because i thought they matched really well yeah and she's got in some little lilac stud earrings she's got quite glittery eye makeup too yeah she's a really really pretty doll i love her yeah don't ask me what her name is though because I, I don't know then I've got this boy. I think he must be a, one of the band members, I think. But I, I, I kept him because I quite liked his clothes and I quite liked his face. He's got a really friendly face, hasn't he? Oh, he's also fraying. Yes, yeah, so tuck that under there, Bernard, you're fraying. Yeah, but yeah, quite like him. I, I, I couldn't tell you which band he's from. It could be One Direction. It could be musical youth it could be the osmonds i've no idea no idea then i have this girl she was a car boot dolly um now she's uh, african princess ilani something like that I, I can't i did look her up and i found out who she was but stupidly i didn't write down who she was it's something like African princess singing Alani, yeah. And she's got these little bobbles in her hair, look. She's in lovely condition. And she's still, even her jacket still lights up, look. How good is that? Yeah, and her hair is, it came out beautiful in the wash, it really did. Yeah, she, but look at her, she's another stunning doll, look. Absolutely love her, I do, yeah, love these dollies. <laughs> Then I have, um, I've got quite a few boys in here actually. Then I have this one. This one I bought from a lady on Facebook. And she is an Avon Barbie, I believe. Oh, look at that. Her elastics come out of her hair. Do you know, it doesn't matter how often I put elastics in these dolls' hair, they come out again. And I did know who she was. Now, I've written it on the bag. Uh, Winter Rhapsody, an Avon Winter Rhapsody doll she is, and she's had her fringe curled just to keep it out of her eyes a bit, yeah, and she's got on her little earrings and she's got her ring, but I do believe that she's, the Winter Rhapsody dolls I've seen don't have these bent arms, so I'm wondering if she's actually on the wrong body, yeah, but they are definitely the Winter Rhapsody clothes, and I'm pretty sure that's the Winter Rhapsody face. I could be, I could be wrong about that, but yeah, she's really pretty, isn't she? And she's a more, she's a more vintage Barbie. I love her. I love those clothes. Yeah. So that's her. Um. Then I have this. This is another Simba doll. She came in the same set as the skating one and she's the one with a little, little baby. She's got a little baby in her tummy. Hold on, let's see if we can do it right. If you, if you get her in the right position and turn her tummy round, you can see the little baby. There you are, look. There's a little tiny baby. Handy like that, wouldn't it? If you could just pop them out like that. Yeah, it would. Uh, but yeah, she's really lovely. She's come up really well in the wash but she again has got that hair that looks it looks like it's turning grey do you know what I mean it's that sort of hair that it doesn't matter what you do to it it looks like it's turning grey yeah a little outfit came out well in the wash though she those Simba dolls all have a similar sort of facial screening don't they or face mould yeah um next I have Jessie from Toy Story and she as well came in that same bundle with those two Simba dolls and I love her. She's the only Jessie I have, yeah. I don't know whether she can be classed as a Barbie but that's what I've got her down as anyway. I suppose she really ought to be in my Disney dolls, didn't she? But yeah, I love Jessie and she came out of the wash really well. She really did. Yeah. Then I have this lady and I don't know who she is but she's another really pretty one. She's got triangle earrings in and she's got bent arms. Um, she's got like crimped, her hair's like wet, like crimped or wavy. I suppose you'd call it crimped, wouldn't you? Yeah, but her hair's lovely. Yeah, and she could do with her fringe curling just to keep it 
what I did was I, I put it in a, a curl and I, and I like boil washed the fringe bit to keep it up like that on that other one yeah but she has the bent arms body I don't know what you call that and she's got a twisty waist and this dress I got separately and popped it on her because I thought it was more fitting than what she had on she's lost a ring she did have a ring originally I, I don't think she came with the ring but yeah she's a pretty dolly isn't she then I have this one who is another very similar I should imagine she's from the same sort of time I can't I couldn't tell you what time it was because I can't actually read it on the back of her head oh I think it says 1976 yeah on the back of her head if that gives you any indication but look at her isn't she beautiful she's got bows in her ears and she's got on this like tutu I do think that is her original dress but these are not her shoes no but they do match pretty well don't they yeah she's another really pretty one isn't she um then I've got this boy I haven't got any trousers for him and I don't know whether he's he is actually a a Ken doll or whether he's one of the uh whether he's from one of the boy bands or or what but he's got articulation in his shoulder look whereas I think the Ken dolls usually go up and down he's he has got articulation in his shoulder he hasn't got any in his legs but look at this look something has eaten his toes yeah something's had toes for dinner yeah but I, I need to find him some trousers really don't I don't him going around with just his top on yeah but I love his hair that's why I kept him absolutely love his hair yeah uh, then I have this Ken he's got all hair on him off the other Barbies yeah he's quite a trendy dude look I might have seen that his arms are like that as well so I'd have got that wrong didn't I yeah here's another Ken I can't quite see what it says on his neck his trousers are falling down he's got a builder's bum yeah but he looks very smart doesn't he yes he does real trendy dude then i've got this one now i i think he should have a bow on there you know like i must make him a little bow he's now he's dressed up all fancy but he's got no sleeves in his shirt no he hasn't I don't know whether his neck's cracked there as well or whether it's just no i think it's just the seam but yeah i can't actually see what it says on the back of his neck i'm hopeless i know i am but yeah, he's an unusual looking one, isn't he? Yeah, and he's got a very wild hairstyle. He needs a bit of gel on that hair. You do, Ken, yeah. But he's quite posh with his shimmery trousers on, isn't he? Yeah. What he needs is a big medallion just there, isn't it, in that outfit. Then I have another boy one, and I think he is a boy band one. And I actually think, I think this top is a a my scene top it, it could be it could be but yeah that's what he i think he's another boy band one but i couldn't tell you what boy band but i just liked his outfit yeah and i kept it on him that's what how he came i think i can't remember but yeah i did like his top you know his little hoodie hmm. and he's got molded on hair so his hair's always tidy yeah yeah, I do like a hoodie, you know. I do, yeah. Uh, then I have a few inbox dolls. I have this one. Uh, she's one of the... Well, I think I think she's a fashion Easter one, but she might not be, you know. Yeah, but I bought her because I thought she was really pretty and I think she was about £5. Yeah, no, I don't think she's a fashion Easter one. I think she's just a, just a, a, a Barbie. But look how pretty that face is. Yeah, I really like her. Then I have... Oh, bear with me. <laughs> I have a Ken. I got him because he was on sale as well. I thought he was very handsome for a, for a boy doll. He's the water play one. Yeah, he's a water play Ken. And then I have... Now, this one is a fashion Easter one. I really like her too. I like her skin tone. thought she was really pretty. Yeah, and I like her dress as well. Yeah, so she's one of these ones. She's number 32. Yeah. And I also have this one. 
She's got a really pretty face as well, hasn't she? I think she's the taller one. She's number 30. Yeah, I think she's the, one of the taller ones, isn't she? Let's have a look on the back. Yeah, she is taller than the others, isn't she? Yeah, yeah, but that's the, that's the, that's all my box dolls, yeah. And then we're on to these ones. These are the, um, these two are from the Teen Beach movie and we've got Brady. I have got another one who's waiting to be dressed and, and done up. Another dark haired girl from this movie as well. So we've got Brady. He's had his makeover, so he's all right. Um, yeah, I've st I have still got a few Barbies who are, are waiting their makeover. So yeah, this isn't my whole um, collection. And then we've got Mackenzie. I love these. I just love them. Yeah. How cute is she? Look, such a pretty doll. I love her. And I love the size of them as well. Yeah, they're a bit smaller than your average. Where's an average Barbie? Yeah, they're just a little bit smaller, look, a little bit shorter. Yeah, I quite like her. I think she's cute. Yeah, so that's her. And then I've got two, two of the three. Now, we three friends. Yes. Here's one. I don't know what the names are. No, I think one of them's called Lila. I think one's called Lila, but I couldn't tell you what the other two are called. Now I've forgotten. <laughs> yeah, I only have two out of the three and they came in separate. I got them separately as well. But yeah, she's dressed in this outfit because she did come, I think, with some orange trousers and a jacket on. But she had a stain on the trousers that I couldn't get out. So I've popped her in these little shorts and these little sneakers. Yeah, she's cute, isn't she? Yeah, and then I've got this one, which I think is Stacy. I think she's Stacy, yeah. How pretty is that doll though? She's so cute, isn't she? I love her. And her little outfit came out really well in the wash as well. Yeah. And she I don't know whether they were original shoes, but they fit her quite well and they match. So yeah, quite happy with that. Yeah, so that's my um Barbie doll collection. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. And that was uh, requested by Ibrahim. So Ibrahim, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you. <laughs> Bye for now.